Hi everyone, I'm Larry the Butcher. So, I want to talk about two things. One thing happened today and one thing happened two weeks ago. I guess we'll talk... No, no, he's fine, he's fine. Um, Casey Neistat, you guys have heard of him. He's, um, said he's not doing daily vlogs. We're not sitting down on this video. No, we're not. You can though. It's the Brandon and Dad show. Why is it so... So this morning I watched my YouTube feed and there's a lot of YouTubers that I like to follow. One of which is Casey Neistat. Casey Neistat's pretty awesome. Great quality, great technique. And he's done stuff that's quite interesting that captivates the audience. Well, today he's giving up on daily vlogs. Which is unfortunate, but there's guys like me to replace him. Um, and by all means, I wish him well, and I'm sure he's got bigger and better projects coming. Um, and that, uh, you know what? It's hard to do it every day. I did it for a month, and I keep trying to get back into it, and I can't, and it sucks. Because I really want to provide you guys with knowledge and entertainment and something that you can, you know, I learned something today. Um, second off, I want to talk about the U.S. election. Yes, I know it was two weeks ago. Yes, I know, um, if you guys recall, I did my who I'm voting for. Bear in mind, I'm Canadian. If I had voted, it would have been illegal, but four million immigrants in the U.S. voted anyway, so I would have probably... Um, in the video of who I voted for... I picked the big giant meteor. We still have hope for that. Um, if I were an American citizen, my first choice would have been Gary Johnson. Um, and if you're a friend of mine, if you know me on Facebook or on Twitter, um, I have over the course of the last three years, um, I guess, uh, no, through the summer, I was saying that between Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton, Donald Trump was the lesser of two evils, but still evil. I honestly didn't expect him to win. It was a big surprise um, for everyone. I'm not going to get into what happened with the Democrat. Maybe I am. Um, Donald Trump's win was caused solely by the Democratic National Convention Committee. Bernie Sanders should have been the candidate. The election probably would have been different. The election would have seemed more honest. But um, my guess, only my guess, is that people at the DNC felt that it had to be a woman running for president. And there will be a woman president one day. It could have been this one, but because I think, from my view, because there was so much overt corruption in the nomination of Hillary Clinton that many borderline voters went to Donald. 46 million of you didn't vote anyway. If you had voted, it could have been different still. Oh, that's the door. Let's see who it is. It's Sunday night and I got a box from Amazon in Canada. Wow. Let's see what's in there. It has my name on it right there. One of the YouTubers I follow is a guy whose channel is called Wranglestar. It's probably not his name. It could be his last name, but um, he did this episode where he had this sharpening system. Um, not this one. I think it's Japanese. Or it could be Korean. We'll find out. Um, So he had this sharpening system that came from Russia. It was gorgeous, and it looked like it did such great work. It's too expensive for me. I'm not at the point where people give me stuff to show on the channel. Isn't it interesting that when you hit a level where you can afford whatever you need on your YouTube channel, they start giving it to you. I'll get there one day. Um, so this is exciting. I'm gonna open this in a different episode. Um, guys, I know this wasn't much of an episode, but thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment down below, uh, start that debate. 
Do you think the election would have been different if Bernie Sanders had been a nominee? Um, and I'll comment more down below about that. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you like what I'm doing. And by all means, share this on all your favorite social media. And guys, thank you once again. I'm so honored that you're taking the time to watch this. We'll see you later. Bye.